Last year's winner of Drive's best SUV under $40,000, the Mazda CX-5, is now in a new category we're calling best small SUV. And it's up against some stiff competition, including an all new Hyundai Tucson and this car, the one that blurs the lines a little, the Volkswagen Golf Alltrack. It doesn't sit as high as most SUVs and it doesn't use a diesel engine, but in other ways, the Volkswagen Golf Alltrack is actually the thinking person's SUV. By sitting a bit lower and using a carb-based driveline, the Golf effectively drives as sweetly and easily as any VW Golf station wagon. The all-wheel drive grip is confidence-inspiring, and keener drivers will be much more likely to accept the all-track as the compromise between the car they want and the car they need, which, after all, is what a good SUV should offer in the first place. Getting an SUV to ride and handle properly is the big challenge, but Mazda seems to have got it pretty right with the CX-5. It not only feels a bit sportier than most other high-riding vehicles, it's also quite smooth and relaxed to drive. The sophisticated diesel engine is a big part of that, but we did find the ESP to be quite intrusive when it did kick in. The interior works well enough, but is looking a bit old generation in 2015, although there's some nice touches such as the one-button seat fold function. Mazda's design language seems to play against the concept a little though, with a relatively tight rear seat and a rear bench that lacks support for bigger folk. It's bigger inside than the Mazda, and the Hyundai Tucson is also very well equipped. In fact, it has a whole lot going for it, including an absolute peach of a diesel engine, and some of the best brakes you'll find on a car anywhere. Hyundai also took time to develop the final suspension tuning locally, and it shows. This is a great SUV. The only catch is that, in right-hand drive form, the Tucson scores just four stars out of five for safety and that's something we simply cannot ignore in such a family-oriented vehicle. But the smart money says Hyundai will fix that in time, in which case we'll revisit it as soon as we can. Drive's best small SUV for 2015 is this car, the Volkswagen Golf Alltrack. The Volkswagen Alltrack was a little bit of a controversial choice this year. Some people thought that because it doesn't look exactly like a conventional SUV, it isn't one. But when you look at it, it is. It's got all-wheel drive and it's, it's included in the price of this car where other times you have to pay extra for all-wheel drive. It does sit higher, you sit higher, it's got the wheel arch extensions, it is a proper SUV. And it's a very classy one. When you look at the way the interior is made, it's nicely put together. It drives beautifully. The 1.8 litre is perky, it's feisty, it makes you want to go for a drive. The gearbox works very well. The VW Golf Alltrack costs $37,990 as tested and comes with a three-year, 100,000-kilometre warranty. The engine makes 132 kilowatts, and the combined fuel economy figure is 6.7 litres per 100 kilometres. If you're the sort of person who really enjoys driving but needs an SUV, then the Alltrack is going to appeal, and that's why it picked up the silverware this year in the small SUV class. It's beautifully made, put together inside, it's quality materials, it's comfortable, it's huge inside because all of the extra length of this car over a Golf is behind the axle, so it's all luggage space. It's accommodating, it's beautiful to drive. It's, it, it is the choice of somebody who actually likes driving but needs an SUV. And in those terms, it was a pretty convincing winner.